Hello there. Random vlog number two of 2020. I don't do enough of this. Or do I do too much of this? I mean too many of this. Fuck if I know. Anyway. In today's... Somehow random vlog worthy news. Gamora is nearing the finish line. Just finished up the um, last map of the bunch. Implemented gameplay, cleaned up the auto map view. And now it's basically down to um, composing the last music track, finding appropriate sound effects, or making my own, in case I feel the need. Uh, organizing the textures. Just essentially, essentially stuff in preparation for packing the whole thing up. And uh, any minor tweaks I may think of. And a full test run of the entire thing with it pack being packed up. And then it's release time. So yeah, Gamora. I was gonna say full release, but... I mean, I guess it's a full release, sort of. But it's by no means the final version, like, it's basically gonna be release candidate 1. Because I do want to give the thing out to other people to play test in a more or less public fashion and then do any changes or tweaks that other people may have given me ideas as to what needs to be improved upon Because that's even going to be a first one for me. After... I believe 11 years of mapping basically just for myself. But yeah, the... Shortly upcoming release is gonna be release candidate one, like I said. People can uh, play it, report bugs, provide suggestions as to what can be done differently, what can be improved, etc. May or may not be a release candidate to And final release is gonna be a uh, sometime. Like version 1.0 essentially. But yeah, that that's whole ramble aside. The first public playable version of Gomorrah is gonna be out either this weekend or next week. Not entirely sure when exactly, but it'll be soon enough. It'll be soon enough.
Man. I actually can't believe I finished that whole project. My first do mapping efforts of this scale since Deliverance to Day 600, basically. Like that, that thing took me a whole two plus years to finish up. Although I was working on it kind of on and off. And frankly, in hindsight, that whole project was almost too ambitious for its own good. Like, the final product is nowhere near as large in scale as it was initially intended to be. Now Gamora, on the other hand, it's... Not necessarily as large scale as Deliverance 2600. Actually, no, it is even larger in scale than Deliverance 2600. Or. Well, if you consider the fact that Deliverance 2600 was a total conversion, whereas. Gamora is basically just a six level map set. I don't know, fuck it. But yeah. My first public re released Doom mapping project of this scale since Jillaran 2600 back in 7 2017. And within a few days from now. It's finally going to be out. And fuck am I excited to share it with the, the internet. And I hope people enjoy playing it as much as I enjoyed making it. But... Yeah. Basically said everything I have to say now. Good time as well. Vlogs just over 8 minutes in length at this moment. So yeah, I'm just gonna wrap this up. Thanks for watching, thanks for listening, if you did. Gamora, coming soon. Be hyped. Or else.